Aaron Krasnikovic was able to get in and, and tie up the rebound. Free throw is up. That one is good. Krasnikovic now with 10. He goes to double figures. He has one more with a chance to get his team to within one. 6-13 to go. And he does. 57-56. 6-10 to go. One point Cougar lead and they have the ball. Comer into the front court. Gets it up to Hogan. Hogan drives. Kicks it up top to Sovine. Now right side to Han. Shot clock down to 17. Han penetrates, gets it to Fox. Fox has been big in the second half and he does it again. Austin Fox with 17 to put his team up three. We're down to 5.40 to go. And the Saints answer. They have it in the corner to Sheriff. Sheriff off a screen. Goes up. Here's a shot for three in the tie. That one too hard. Rebound is tipped. Picked up. Bounced on the other side. And the ball lost out of bounds. It will stay with St. Francis. And boy, the Saints got away with one there. Morrison had tried to throw it down on the baseline. He didn't realize the Cougars had two players there. And the ball sailed out of bounds. Luckily, the Cougars were the last one to touch it. Yeah, and Cougars trying to save it end up sliding all the way over oh way off the court out near the uh, the, the stairs leading to the uh, mezzanine here's a three to tie that one is short and the rebound picked up by the Cougars couple of shots by the Saints not dropping Hogan kick out here's a shot for three that one is nailed three. that's a huge right shot right there Summer. because that puts the Cougars back up by six at 62-56 after the Saints were shooting for a tie. Saints got to be careful not to panic here. They still got plenty of time, but the Cougars, well, I'll tell you what, every time they just seem to have an answer. And again, that is a team that is very experienced in this national championship. Aliyah kicks it outside. Here's another shot for three. That one does drop down. And timeout will be called. Presta Kovacs gets the three to go. 43 to go. Coaches come out of the timeout. The teams do. Ryan March for the Saints. Chad Lacrosse for the Cougars. Tell you what. This game has two of the things I really like, and I've said this before on other broadcasts. I have been an admirer of the way St. Francis, the Cougars, play basketball. Very fundamental but hard-nosed basketball. Exactly. I mean, just very much to the grindstone. But I've been very impressed with the Saints there today, too, because even though the Cougars have given them their best shot, they still keep coming back and still hang in there. Big possession here, and there's a turnover. I tell you what, they wanted to go for the three right there but decided not to, and they're going to hold it up. 62-59. Saints are down by three, but with the ball. Chris Popovich on the right wing. Quick pass inside was too hard. Right idea, but I think the Cougar defense may have kind of dictated that. I think that Chris Popovich felt like he had to throw, put a little bit more on it and just got it out of, out of reach there. And, and that's, and they, you know, they set out. That's why they didn't shoot the three initially, because they wanted to uh, get a good offensive possession. Again, right idea, just uh, didn't, weren't able to execute. Comer thought about a three. Instead, here's a wide open look for a three by Small, and that one is no good. And the rebound down to St. Francis. The Saints, again, a chance to tie with the three at four minutes to go. I have a feeling this may be just the tip of the iceberg of some of the games we got going on today. Three is missed outside, but if Whistle had blown the play dead before the shot even went up, as the Saints are heading to the free throw line, Ilyayev now will have a chance for a one in the bonus. Eighth team foul on the Cougars. Both teams are in the bonus now. Glad you came up for the first game today. Oh, yeah. This has been entertaining. We kind of had fun with the two schools being the same name, but these two teams also did something very important. They came to play basketball this morning. They're giving us a good first sh showing here in the second day of the national championship as we're down to a minute 14 to play. Fox kicks it outside. 
Small has it outside. Down to 18 to shoot. Here is Comer. Now down to 13 to shoot. We are down to a minute to play. Fox, he's been the man in the second half, and he is again. Austin Fox with 19. Great patience that time by Fox. Not only did he get it, he waited on time, and then he just took his time, went up, and calmly stayed in the game. So it looks like that Raspopovich is going to inbound the ball. Have a couple of bigs. They also have a good three-point shooter in the game. They are going to guard the inbound pass. So here we go. One second to go. This to decide which St. Francis moves on. They go the ball long, and it's intercepted. Game over. They were lobbing for a three over on the opposite corner. Nice defense by the uh, St. Francis, Indiana team. But I tell you what, it, they, the Indiana team is going to uh, advance here. What a treat for both these teams to open.